Hi guys, happy Monday. Hey, it's Sonia here with Spotlight Realtor Network um, Productivity Coaching Program. And um, today I just wanted to, uh, well, we're right back to business, right? Everyone's been having a, a, a crazy weekend, I see with all your photos, me too, with Halloween. And yet we're pros and we're getting right back to business. So I'm straight out of the conference today again. Um, but uh, I wanted to do a video about what I've invested in for my business and I'd love to hear some of you guys' ahas and as well as um, anything that you've invested in that I'm not mentioning here um, just in terms of growing your business to grow your business so um, the number one thing of course that I've invested in is, is my clients um, you do have to spend some money to make some money right so um, I do pay for a lot of things for my clients, for my coaching clients, so that they don't have to dish out that money up front and they can learn the systems and the tools and kind of pick and choose what works for them in terms of their real estate business. So you would not believe this, but I literally spend $28,000 a year on each one of my clients. And that's a huge benefit because if they were to go to another brokerage, um, what they would be having to pay for on their own is $28,000 worth of equipment, different tools, software, hardware, all kinds of things like that, that, that I already pay for them. So that's pretty awesome, including leads. Um, <clears throat> but, uh, but what I found is in order for us to, uh, make some money, if I spend that money, I do make more than that back. Obviously it has to be a red light, green light type of thing. So, um, don't spend it where it's not bringing you anything, obviously. Um, investing, of course I invest in myself. So when I talk about investing in myself, um, I don't just mean the hair and the makeup. <laughs> I mean the conferences, the seminars, um, the travel that I need to do to be able to go get that information that I need, um, as well as a lot of different online courses, uh, books, events. Um, so I would love to hear what kind of events you guys have invested in that really you feel like you're getting a really good return on investment. I, I don't want to invest in things that, um, you know, end up just being uh, fun networking events only. They need to also uh, be something that I can measure. And I go into these events with a lot of purpose and a plan on what I what exactly I want to get out of them. Questions um, that I have, specific people I need to find and talk to, and so forth and so forth. Because that's my second thing. Um, the third one is of course, relationships. So when we're talking about referrals in our database, that is the number one thing. I do spend um, on relationships and I invest in those relationships as well. So if you'd like to have my further plan for that, I can I can definitely share that with you. There's a couple of different things I do. I do a referral uh, plan so uh, with other agents and I also do a... Um, kind of like an ABC grouping plan for people that do give me referrals. So um, I, if you're interested, let me know. I'll share those with you as well. And of course, I invest in a coach. So I pay for a business coach for myself, and that is uh, $1,000 a month. And I'm telling you, it is so important. I know I've said it before, but the month that I... Uh, started working with my coach, I definitely made, that is when I started making some serious money. So, because you need someone to be able to help you see what you're not seeing, right? So I know I've said that before, but invest in coaching, invest in yourself through coaching, and, and I think that that's really the, the guiding, they'll help you stick to the things that you don't remember to stick to always, because, you know, life happens. So, hey, Avi, hey, Tiff. Um, okay, and then the other thing I've invested in is some stuff. Now, it's not necessarily to grow my business per se. However, in the world of real estate, the day that we sell our last house is when our income stops coming in. Unless you invest your money in uh, more ways than one, right? So I'm always looking to find ways in which uh, I can have as many streams of income coming in as possible. So one of, the, one of those things is stocks. Um, if you want to get started with stocks, get started with something uh, just easy and smaller, I would say download the Acorns app onto your phone 
and I can also post a link to that if you're interested. I believe it gives you some cash to start with if you use my link. Um, Acorns will help you invest in different, for instance, real estate portfolios, um, easier stocks that have more of a steady growth, and it can also help you save money through them. It's pretty cool. If you haven't used it, it's really simple to start with, and you can just kind of learn it as, learn as you go. And, um, and then another pool of money for me is profit share. So in Keller Williams, we do name a sponsor when we, um, yeah, you use Acorns, that's awesome. I love it too. I just started using it uh, maybe like a month ago and it's already grown, so I'm super stoked. Um, but there's other apps out there too. So whichever one you like, don't, don't just go with mine. Whichever, if you got other ones, um, use those. There's similar types of things out there, right? So. Anyway, um, profit share. Profit share is a system that I uh, that we have in Keller Williams. Meaning, if our office makes a hundred thousand dollars this month in profit, fifty percent of that goes back to the agents who helped grow that office. So that's really exciting. So when agents don't join our office, um, they once they start making some money, whoever brought them in gets a piece of that cake, which is awesome. I love that. Um, so these are things that I've invested in personally to grow my business i would like to know what you guys are doing to grow your business what kind of things are you investing in to grow your business um if you've got some great ideas i'd love to hear those i also like masterminding and talking about how to invest in general and i've definitely taken some some great money classes myself before so um Please let me know in the comments and um, I hope you all have a powerful week. I'll be doing these lives this week every single day. So um, I will see you all soon and um, have a powerful week. I already said that. Okay, bye.